Is your GPU crashing in Windows 11? You're running a game and the game crash, or you are simply in your desktop and you get a GPU error? Well guys, on this video I'm going to show you how to fix that. But before we start, don't forget to drop a like into the video and to subscribe to the channel for more content like this one. Let's begin. There are a lot of different options that you can do to fix this problem. The first one that we're going to do is to update Windows. For that, you want to right click into the start button, go into your settings, and on the left side, go where you see Windows Update. From there, you want to click into check for updates, and if you have any update available, install it in your system and restart your PC. Now, the second option that we can do is, of course, to update our graphic drivers. And there are several ways to do this, but I'm going to show you one of the easiest ones that is to open your web browser. And depending if you are using NVIDIA or AMD, the links are going to be in the description down below. For NVIDIA, you want to select the type of graphic card that you have, GeForce, GeForce RTX, in my case is the 20 series, and then select the graphic card that you have, in my case is the 2080 Super. In here, you want to select the operating system that you're using, Windows 11, and if you want the game ready drivers or the studio drivers, the language, and click into search. Now, this is going to show you the latest update of the drivers that they have, and you want to click into download and install them from there. And for AMD, it's almost the same thing. Select graphics, select the AMD Radeon RX series that you have in your PC, and from there, select your graphic card and click into submit. And right here, you're going to find the AMD software Adrenaline Edition, and with that, you can download and install the drivers. Now, the third option is to check what version of DirectX you have installed in your system. Go into the search bar and type RON. You're going to see the RON app, click on it, and into this small box, you want to type DXDI. Press OK, and underneath, you're going to see the DirectX version that you have, in my case, DirectX 12, if you don't have DirectX 12, you want to try to update it and download it from the Microsoft website. One last option, if you guys are overclocking your GPU and you're having these problems, you want to go a little bit lower with your core clock or your memory clock to try to fix that problem. And that is pretty much it, guys. These are the best options that you can do. If you're still having problems, just let me know in the comments down below. I will try to find a solution for you guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like and all of the things and see you guys on the next time. Bye-bye.